It was the nature and working with fish that uh, drew my interest to work with the aquaculture. I'm Martin and I'm working as an assistant produce management for Aquare Arctic. I worked for Aquare Arctic for six years. I was studying in Bode, aquaculture and management. Then I saw Aquare Arctic at the TV series and then I got a job as a summer worker. Nu kan du starte fodringen igjen på alle meirene. Jeg er veldig excited by the new teknologi i aquaculture. Det går veldig really fast de siste årene. Når jeg startet, vi har bare startet med kameraer i pannene. Og nå har vi en kamera i alle pannene, og de kontrollerer feeding på feedingstasjonen. Porsjontralen kunne også gitt meg temperaturen på meg fire på Breivika. Det er 10 grader i mer fire. My name is Caroline and I'm working as the leader on the feeding station. We are a team on five people who work here every day. We use cameras so we don't overfeed. Our feed has a higher level of omega-3s and are clean for toxin and PCBs. It has a low footprint with only 0.5 kilos fish in to produce one kilo fish. We are looking on the temperature and the oxygen levels in the pens. We can tell that the fish is healthy by using the cameras to see the appetite and the behavior on the fish. And we also have lasers that we position to have the fish in front of the cameras. The lasers can move from side to side and up and down. And we can use the data for biomass, skin health. Some of the negative impacts fish farming can have is we having too much sea lice. And we have the lasers in the pens that kills the sea lice. Not to take 20 fish on every meal. Love for that every week. We use bedøvelse for to bedøve fish when we take it out. When the fish begins to lay it on the side, can we take it out. So there you see it. It's very small. If you have over 0,5 kjønnsmoden, Hållus så är du nött till att behandla fisken så måste du inte avlusa den. Fish farming is important because it make working places for people and if it don't have uh, fish farming uh, I think it's uh, don't have been people on the island on the coast of Norway. We both are from the mainland and we uh, just had to try the opportunity to live on an island. We are actually a couple and living together. It's amazing to live on a small island because everybody is talking to everybody and we have amazing nature around us, both the mountains and the ocean. We need fish farming to get sustainable food to the world. 